What's cracking YouTube? My name's Roddy and welcome back to my breakthrough box for opening. And this is part number two. So let's get um straight into it with another nine packs. Let's see if I can just get nine straight off the right side, probably. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Just straight off the front. Let's just do that. That will do. So I'm just gonna trim the tops off these guys here, and I'll see you guys in a moment. Alrighty guys, and we're back. So, what I just did then, I don't know if you noticed at the end of the little speed up, I kind of felt the packs and just, I wanted to see um, if I can pick what, what packs are going to have the pull. So, I picked three, and they're right at the end of this part, so be sure to stay tuned to the end, and we'll see if I um, if I pick the goods, and yeah, we'll, it'll be fun. But yeah, if you guys have not seen part number one, part number one was actually really good. For wise, we got some good stuff, and yeah, I'll probably leave a link just in the description description of this video, but without further ado, let's just get cracking straight into this Zorok break pack. Yeah, I have this, I have this kind of like thing where I just like to, um, see if I can feel the packs that have the good pulls, but we're kicking it off way too strong. This is why you cannot, um, why you cannot just feel it by hand sometimes, just because cards like this are uh, hidden, are uh, hidden, and what is this card, what is this card, do we have a Glalie Spirit Link, is it a Mega Gl a Glalie, Earth Ring Reverse, and a Bridget for Art, we got the Bridget Bay, awesome, what a way to start off part number two, look at her, she's just like swinging her, swinging her uh, professor jacket around, like trying to be all sassy and stuff. Look at that stance, the power stance. <laughs> oh dear, I give so many people um, troubles at work for how they do that sassy stance. But anyway, so what's this do? Let's have a read. Search your deck for up to one basic Pokemon EX or three basic Pokemon except for Pokemon EX and put them onto your bench. Shuffle your deck afterwards. So you can choose an EX or three basic Pokemon and throw them straight on your bench. So it's a kind of like a good setup card, so Bridget, awesome card, love it, the green with her orange hair, oh brownie orange, looks amazing, I'm so happy about that pull, so let's keep going, so obviously um, that's one pack down that I didn't um, hand weight correctly, but yeah there's the code for this pack, and let's see if this card can prove me wrong as well, my pack picks for the last three. So, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Whoops, we just skipped over here for task. Cubone. Reserve ticket, let me get back up. <sighs> just trying to read that Bridget card on my, through my phone, because I get better zoom that way. But we get a chest spin reverse, and a Dodrio. Nice. With a Retreat Aid and Fury Attack. So retreat A, what's that do? As long as this Pokemon is on your bench, your active Pokemon's retreat cost is two colours. Is that right? Or, or two energies less. Oh no. <laughs> Let's just go with that. Zorok break pack up. Let's keep that one off to the side. I'll give out the code for the next pack, so be sure to stay stay tuned throughout the video for any code giveaways that I do. We got a Rome Raid, we've got an Axew, a Woobat, Buddy Buddy Rescue, Stun Fisk, a Bridget. Oh, we got a Flogus break. So we got the Bridget, Bridget to go with the Bridget Full Art there. And then we just got this nice looking Flogus break. I was I was waiting for one of these. I didn't um I didn't expect it at all. <laughs> That's awesome. And then to finish it off we have a Marowak, regular air. I'm still waiting for that double, the double pull. I've seen it, and I want it. <laughs> but anyway, we've got um, Forge Break. I'll see if I can get a nice close-up for you guys to pause and have a read of Floral Breeze. 
But yeah, awesome. So that's two. So we got like a girly kind of theme going on right now. We got the Bridget and the Floyd spray. Pack number four of this part. Let's oh actually. There we go. As promised. As promised. Three and two. Once again, not expecting anything out of this pack. Going by my um my hand weighing kind of theory. Well, not really hand weighing, more, more so just by thickness, pack thickness. But we got Dodo Reverse and Sea Sage. The reason why I've kind of I kind of did the thickness thing is just because that's all you have to go off when you see these display boxes in shops or like at the counter. That's all you have to go by. You don't have like a scale to be weighing weighing the packs or anything like that. You kind of just have to look at it and go, "Oh, this one feels alright. Let's let's see what we can do." And yeah, it's all it's all just chance. So we got double chest bin to start this pack off. A rufflet, Wubat. three chest bin <laughs> in this pack so far. A Mewtwo Spirit Link, Cacturn. Can we make it four with the reverse? No, we can't. We got a snuggle. And to finish this pack off, we have a regular air Florgus to go with our Florgus break. So there you go. Let's knock that up a little bit. And that's how you see it on the field. On the play mat. But yeah. Nice. Let's see if Florgus wants to sit up the back again. Let's knock this back down. Knock this back down. Okay, so we got Houndoom. So, what are we up to? So, my three pack picks are there. We're on to the last pack that I thought had nothing. So, there's two packs so far that I couldn't tell had something. Can this pack prove me wrong? But we got Spritzy, Cacnea, Snova, Afroki, Zoroa, Behem, Paladin, Vanillish, Raichu Break. Nice. I just, I just don't see these breaks coming, hey? They just don't give me any, any warning. Awesome. And then can we get the double? Can we get the double? No, we can't. We got a knockout. Okay. With high flight and speed dive. But nice, a right you, a right you break. A grand bolt. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So that breaks the, um, the womanly, womanly, feminine. The theme we had going for this part. Oh, I couldn't spit that out, but there we go. There we go. So this is one of my pack picks. So let's see if, if this pack can give us a holo or an ultra or something. Let's let's see. Let's see. We got a Magnemite, Pikachu, Cacturn, Seeking, a Parallel City. Okay. So fun little fact. I think these guys are two in a boost box, okay? So if you go down to the shops expecting a parallel city, I wouldn't expect too much because there's yeah, two two out of 36 packs. But we got a pretty plot reverse and a glade hollow. Okay, so I'm on one one out of one so far. One out of one. And not a bad pull at all. With premonition and sensitive blade. Awesome. Let's see if I can go two for two. But this is a rock break pack art. I don't know you guys. I don't know if I can do it. But we got Stinke, Chespin, Doduo, Fennekin, Zorua, Breakson, Super Rod, Granball, and Miss Magius Reverse Rare. That's not even bad. So if I don't even get anything, that's a reverse of a Hollow Rare. So that's pretty sweet to just to begin with. And a Staraptor. Okay, so I couldn't I couldn't pick it. But we did get the reverse of the holo rare. So that's pretty sweet. That makes it Miss Magius. And the final pack of this part, we have the Mega Mewtwo X pack art. Let's see what we can do. So if you guys that have hung through the video, there's the final card for this one. Final code card, that is. And let's see if we can end it off as strong as we started. We have Elgin, Pan Sage, Piplop, Magnemite, Annoybat, Breakson, Pileswine, Houndoom, Spirit Link that is, 
And then we got a bronze or reverse with a bronze on rare. Okay, so I got one out of three. <laughs> so my little hand weighing in this instance just was completely off. But yeah, we got the bronze on and then the oh bronze or then the bronze on to finish it off. Nice. So let's have a quick part recap. We did get some nice stuff in this part, so definitely no complaints here. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So we have the Miss Magnus Reverse Rare. We got the Gallade Hollow. The Raichu Break. Flogus Break. And then we got the Bridget Full Art. So I didn't really look at the texture too much on this card. What, what kind of texture we got here? It feels It's like a bricky kind of texture. Like it comes across... I think you can see it there in the light up the top here. It comes across in like lines. Like thicker lines. I don't know. It's like... But that's interesting, yeah. Nice. So we got the Bridget for light. So if you guys enjoyed this part, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'd much really appreciate any feedback. Um, it really helps me and the channel. But yeah, let me know in the comment section below what you think of this sassy Bridget art. I think it's pretty sassy, personally. But yeah, um, sure. once again, just be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in part number three. Peace.